Greetings and salutations, and welcome back to our Let's Play of EU4 with Red Bastardus Georgia. When we last left our nation, we had invaded Lithuania with Russian support, and Lithuania is allied to Sweden and Austria. We stack wiped the Lithuanian army here in Podolia, giving us a nice troop advantage. We now outnumber them two to one. And Lithuania's war exhaustion is climbing. We lost the war goal a second ago, but we will pick it right back up. Now the concern for a manpower pool. Let's split up these armies. Okay, now the war goal is back in our hands. Persian Separatists, oh, we don't want to deal with you guys right now, just the Ottomans are over, that's bad, we don't want to deal with you guys right now either. Okay, Sweden's enthusiasm is medium, I'm wondering if we could just white piece them out. Should be able to soon. Sorry, nose is itching. So I'm gonna rub that and try to talk at the same time. Fingers in front of the mic and so on. Okay, let's keep getting troops. Moved up from here. Vampire pool is hurting. Uh, let's see, where can we support an army this size? Nowhere, really. So let's move it down here. Merge them together. Split them up. And that rebalanced army should be better able to operate on the battlefield attrition free okay so we could ask them to break their alliance and maybe give us a little cash okay sweden is now out of the war that's great because now we outnumber them three to one. And our military attack just got better. Let's see, we're going for the one with four shock. Why don't we get the guy with Siege here? I don't have any cannons in that army. So we'll rearrange them a little bit more as we push our way up. Actually, we should go here to Belts. Okay, their enthusiasm is just borderline medium slash low. I wish Bohemia would join him, because they could just siege out Austria's capital, and that would make our life so much easier. Okay, Austria, could we white piece you? Not yet. But I have a feeling that's going to come. Let's put all of our cannons. Ick. Okay, so what we want to do here, we're going to lose 2,000 manpower, which I don't want to lose. 
let's just make sure that we don't have any manpower and we lose that and cancel those Okay, they're likely trying to move down here to engage us. We don't want to be in farmlands or grasslands. We really want to be in woods and places with some sort of defensive bonus. Let's see if we can move down here. But we want the skin. They're going for the war goal. religious idea or tech. Let's go for tech. Fortunately, Austria's getting a lot of war exhaustion as they're running around. So our enthusiasm is going to continue to drop, even if they do all right in the battles. Okay, hopefully you'll talk about this stuff and then move into Ottoman territory. Unfortunately, the Ottomans are involved in that war with Serbia still. Seventeen reasons, sixteen. Let's keep an eye on this while we're waiting. Persian separatists, well they're unlikely to fight each other. Yeah, we're gonna have to send our entire army down there to deal with that. While that battle's ongoing, they're not going to be eager for peace, but they lost it. Hopefully they get stack wiped here. It didn't pan out that way, but what do you do? Okay, captured yet another province. This is a core. That's a core. Um, could we get access through you, is the question. We could. So let's head over there. And I think if we just park our army on top of Vienna. Ooh. Why don't we hit him here? I was going to say, as long as we park our army on Vienna, I think they will sue for peace. But if we stack wipe their army, we might also be able to persuade them to see things our way. Leska died. Okay. Austria, peace out. And we still have a little bit of manpower, which is great because we got rebels all over the place. We have these rebels. These rebels. Okay, I think we can get this stuff. They wouldn't quite accept yet. They're in some serious denial.
Okay, we'll march this guy over here. We don't need all of our troops any longer. Um, Lithuania probably doesn't even have much of an army. Yeah, 8,000 men. We can let, actually, let's pull back this army as well. We can let Russia do most of the fighting at this point. Pull all of our troops out. Let our subject and Russia fight. Okay, so we wanted 66 war score worth of stuff. And, but we should give Russia something. And I would like some money. So we might as well just wait till we capture both of these um, forts. Maybe even that one, depending on how things work out. Okay, what's your mission? Defeat Lithuania. I don't know what the conditions are for that. Let's go ahead and do a river crossing here. They don't have a general, so I think we'll be okay. Still have Genoa marked as a nation of special interest. That's pretty hilarious. And they did move back into our territory. It's not something I wanted to see. March these guys down south. All right, fifty seven percent chance. Oh. Hope that. Um, these guys stay in Lithuanian territory. Wow, Teutonic Order got beat up. Tabriz is now converted. At least they're nice enough to move here into the dry lands. We'll just march them south. Is this another group of 24,000 Persian separatists that could enter our territory at any moment's notice? Okay, let's get some cash. We really want to give them that. Is there anything else we could take? We could take uh, this province. As well for our subject. It's a fort, isn't it? Yeah, it is a fort, so I definitely want to take that. Okay, I think this is a pretty good peace deal. Okay, we want an alliance with Spain again. Or... Let's see. So they joined the Protestant side. Of 
for your rivals. England, England. So let's rival England. And I'm hoping that Russia does not join the Protestant League. Let's join the Catholic League. Give it a month. And hope that things change. Let's put them as friendly. And let's see, who else could we rival? Um, France seems like a good one. Let's go ahead and revoke our embargo. Probably have to revoke one. here as well. Okay, they want some of our territory. We might end up losing both of these alliances, which would put us in an awkward situation. Okay, Ottomans like us a little again. Hopefully they'll decide to drop their um, desire for those provinces now that they have friendly reputation or friendly attitude. Those are mountains, so I'm just going to leave those troops there in case these Persian separatists cross into our territory. Okay, we'll get that cash and see if we can, yeah, we can pay off that loan. We're still losing money. We've got a large army. But then we're going to start consulting it down now that we don't have the manpower to support it. Oh, okay. Do we give the clergy even more influence? Yes. We're going to lose some in 10 years. We might have to just pull a province from them. Few provinces in all likelihood. Let's pull that from... And this would be sufficient. Okay, they want a little bit more land though. Okay. Why don't you guys take that? Okay, how are we doing on tech? We're ahead of time on military techs. So why don't we just I guess we just try developing somewhere? Seeing if that drops it down. Okay, they still desire a bunch of our stuff. Let's wait till they're out of that war. Okay, nobility wants more land. What could we give our nobility? 
this. Stability cost modifier. Uh, it's not the thing that's really draining our economy. It's uh, these troops. Actually, we could just elevate them all down. Okay, we'll take stock of the situation. Okay, where are we actually providing reinforcements? I don't think we actually are. Yeah, so that modifier should go away in a month or two. Okay, we need to deal with that if Alicia Volhinia doesn't on their own. Keep them permanently stationed there, and let's see. Okay, we could pick up an alliance here, but I'll try and get this Ottoman alliance back. Let's wait to see what happens when they're at peace. Most of this negative relations is minus 200 or greater from having um, hostile relations uh, over all of their other claims on our stuff. Yeah, I no, can't do anything about that. Okay, it looks like those rebels were suppressed. So let's pair troops. Smallest wages we possibly can justify. And we'll just keep an eye on rebel chance and these relations. There's an Ardalon now. See if they have any cash. 95 ducats. Nothing remarkable. And the other men might lose this territory. Okay, if we hold out for tech, we could get the administrative monarchy government form. I think that'd be better for us. It'll help our economy. Let's see how long this video has been going on for. Uh, 23 minutes. We'll keep it up a few more. And once this gets to be too high, we'll just develop a little bit to get this down to like 79. Or we'll strip one single province from them. Even if that upsets them, the dominant. So the clergy will start to tick downward. And we could just keep doing that back and forth. Okay, we're not embargoing our rivals, so let's go ahead and embargo. Those conversions coming.
Lost our general. That's unfortunate. He's a good general. I'm holding up the tech. Let's see if we can accept another culture. That would be really nice. And we could court this. I'm actually going to do that right now. So I want that autonomy to be zero for the sake of sake of cash. And we could add in some states in here. We're allowed some more. No, thought we're able to. Oh, it was just that one. Okay, our clergy wants a little bit of land, um, but let's let this dominance of the clergy tick down a little bit first. Okay, no guys separatists are organizing, so let's start marching some troops up here. And we'll start paying their wages along the way. Okay, Ottomans still want all that stuff. Okay, what if we were to offer to sell you Trebizond? They are broke. Yeah, we'll wait a little bit. I mean, hopefully they'll just get rid of... Nice. Hopefully they'll just get rid of um, that one Sir Provinces modifier. And then we'll be able to ally them. Ah, uh, let's just pay them their full wages. Okay, disasters down to 11. We can get more states, we'll see what that does. For um, influence. Okay, so we want to state here. There. And now we'll have to expand into this region. We'll hand one of these off to the clergy just as soon as we can core it. Somewhere like this. It's kind of a crappy trade good. And probably this one too. Okay, no guys, separatists are disbanding. Okay, disaster might start ticking upward again. That's okay, we only have to juggle it for a little while like this. Lost the general.
Okay, Ottomans are getting less and less hostile. And let's check on this video. It's 30 minutes, so I'm going to stop here.